Okay, this is probably one of the most gruesome things we have at St. Martin's. This is the parish whipping post. Um, in the old days, uh, the, the church parish was the local form of government. It wasn't just the religion, it was the local government, and the parish council was the, was the local government for the area. In those days, there weren't police, there were parish constables and parish beetles, um, and one of the forms of punishment for small crimes, like stealing something from the market, or forgery, or blasphemy, or things like that, drunkenness, you could be sentenced by the vestry council. Uh, you could be sentenced by the local council, which was the church council, you could be sentenced to be whipped. And this, from 1752, is our whipping post. You can't quite see up here, but there was uh, a wood carved St. Martin's up there. So, uh, that's the remnants of it. And you can still see the bits on the side where chains and things were. So somebody would actually be chained to this and whipped. Wow. Uh, right up here on what's now Trafalgar Square. Um, this was a crude form of punishment, uh, but there weren't that many prisons in the day. Uh, this was the minor form of punishment. Uh, it was whipping, this so-called corporal punishment was outlawed in 1791 for women, and was outlawed for men in 1837. And that's about the point at which the parish stopped being the local bit of government, and London started to form a new local government. But this is, and we still have it, hope we don't ever need it again, whipping post. <laughs>